Project 60, stop an arterial bleed using a variety of tourniquets. There are quite a number of tourniquets available on the market, and if required, one can create an improvised tourniquet. Project 61, stop an arterial bleed using a cat tourniquet. Kindly note, wearing protective clothing is recommended. Non-medical professionals may freely take part in the simulation project and are also allowed to apply these skills gained on real patients in an emergency or disaster situation. A tourniquet on time exceeding two hours may compromise the survival of the limb. You will need the Control Bleeding Simulation Arm, the Combat Application Tourniquet, or Cat Tourniquet. Familiarize yourself with the various parts of the Cat Tourniquet. The Friction Adapter Buckle, the Windlass Rod, the windlass clip, the windlass strap, the omni tape band. Follow these steps to apply the cat tourniquet on the apprentice doctor's simulation arm. All participants should wear a pair of clean gloves. Identify the smaller artery on the simulation arm. It is marked with red tape. Identify the simulation arm's tourniquet zone. The connector should be open on the inflow side of the artery. Ensure that the IV tube roller clamp is in the closed position. Connect the IV line to the inflow side of the simulation arm's artery using a connector. Close the BP cuff valve and inflate the cuff to about 120 millimeters mercury, representing the average adult systolic pressure. Open the IV tube roller clamp and wait for the fake blood to flow out of the artery tube. Stop the bleed by applying the cat tourniquet as follows. Place the simulation arm through the loop of the Omni tape band in the tourniquet area. Once placement of the cat tourniquet is correct, tighten the Omni tape band then secure it onto itself with the Velcro. The cat tourniquet should fit quite securely around the simulation arm. Twist the windlass rod until the bleeding stops, about three to four times, then insert it into the windlass clip. Thread the excess Omni tape band through the windlass clip, then secure it using the windlass strap. Make a note of the tourniquet placement time on the strap or on a notepad.